and i'm here with grandmaster abhijit kunte who's been playing a huge role in helping team india reach the quarter finals abhijit india topped the pool stages how's the feeling i think it was a great uh, achievement because uh, we first day we had some miss with france but then the team played extremely well and we won i think all the important matches okay last round was in the way we were winning so uh, you were already qualified in yeah. even if we lost we were top of the group yes. so did that cause some bit of like everyone was a bit relaxed before the round or no, basically we made the last minute changes because we wanted to try out few players because they were not in the form so we thought that the, this round will give them the opportunity to come back in the game and uh, that was the only reason uh, we had some last minute changes so that also put the pressure in unfamiliar situation but uh, it was a good try felt yeah I, do you think that right now going into the quarter finals where the margin of error is very low that all the players are in their optimum shape yeah the players are doing good but also we need to have a clear cut idea what is our plan and who is in the form and uh, what are the uh, problem areas they have so this was a good round where we could test everyone right and i think uh, in quarter finals we will be facing most likely ukraine yes uh, any thoughts on that well i can't announce now <laughs> <laughs> but but okay overall speaking about this event what ha what is your major role like what what are the things that you have to be doing throughout uh, the event well i think uh, it's about uh, few training ideas uh, with the players and uh, sometimes when they have some issues we need to resolve it uh, for the games and apart from that uh, deciding like whom to field whom not to field i think that is a bit tricky issue because the three of our players are playing from their locations then uh, others are here and according to their form and according to what opponent is doing Hmm. so we had a lot of combinations possible so there are a lot of parameters first yeah. you see what the player is conf comfortable against then you also see that who has a better score against the opponent uh, then you also see that whether white color black color who is at home who is here all of those things yeah no i think see the main thing is we need to have a clear cut idea in this qualifying pool that who are our best players whom we are going to field in quarter semis and finals so it was very important to give chance to everyone and identify our best team you know whom we can field in the future games so giving that opportunity to everyone but at the same time making sure that we win the pool stage i think that was the most important because you never know how how players will feel and how players will play yeah so today actually anand uh, finishing with 4 out of 5 he won his game was a very good result for india he also won his game against hungary uh, and also vidit uh, scoring two wins against strong opponents bologan and lenik luka was also very very good for team india yeah we wanted vidit to win some games because he had the first two days he had a draw he was better but he could not convert the advantage so it was uh, like fielding him in the final round was decision was taken just 5 minutes before so all this last minute changes had to be done because we want him to come back he is our second best player right now and hari has been playing extremely well today okay he had a bad day but uh, he saved the last round yeah <laughs> the rook <laughs> blunder miracles uh and about yourself you have been one of the top players of india uh back in the early 2000s and now you are in this role of a coach i think you are the head coach of aicf as well so how is that feeling you know like now it's full time training for you 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 used to play tournaments a lot i don't think you play any more there weren't many happening because of the pandemic but what's on the cards now yeah i think i played last in 2019 december national premier and then this pandemic struck so okay i played few events online but online was not my cup of tea i think mm. so i thought that okay let's now it's already 2 years so in some time i had to shift my playing mode to maybe a different role i had to play so i thought maybe this is a good uh, time that i should do that uh, regarding this uh, chief coach uh, well nothing much is happening but we have some plans with the federation where uh, we are trying to set up something permanent where the training facilities 
and the identified players can be trained uh, over the national the uh, center yeah, for yes. chess right i think i think secretary has already informed and apart from that uh, we also made sure that uh, players get the best facilities uh, also from the government and also from the federation so be it be world cup or now this uh, online olympiad or this uh, now we will have world women team championship in spain so players get best of the facilities so they don't have to worry about anything else apart from playing so right. that's one of the idea and also they get the best training facilities also and best available coaches actually it's uh, really nice that uh, more and more chess players are getting into the administration i can see here that you guys also take a lot of uh, proactive role on when the food is going to arrive because as a player you know that it's very important for the players to get that yeah i think the players when they're playing i i when i was playing i wouldn't have liked any discomfort other than playing chess so you know like we have so many problems to solve this variation is not working that variation is not working Correct. yesterday the new game has come i had to find the solutions so all this is in your mind and then even a small uh, inconvenience can cause a big disturbance what in your thinking process so uh, i think if you give that whatever they want to do it, if it is streamlined i think it's much easier for players because they can concentrate fully on the games and it's all mind game so you know like you de- you never know that what is going to affect your game so try to keep things simple and very very straight forward amazing and lastly you have been here with the young talents as well of india you're seeing pragnananda nihal also vaishali every time people ask this question what's so special about them do you feel something like you have working with them or talking to them that there is something special in them which makes them stand out from the rest i think they they are confident that is the most important thing and they are fearless of course now everybody is working hard everybody has a training method schedule good coaching but i think uh, what uh, separates them from others is the confidence and uh, the amount of see you today you see that uh, pragyanan came back very strongly with two wins so that kind of thing that when you are uh, pushed to the wall and you come back very strongly i think that is a quality of a good player right right and yes all of them showing that in ample measure and abhijit uh, do you in any way feel pressure as being the coach or you know being a part of this team that we should win a medal from here or you are relaxed on that front well i think it's it's less than playing chess <laughs> the pressure of being coach uh, so but of course uh, the pressure is there i will not deny that well we hope that team india does well and thank you so much for your time thank you sir thank you